Here is the ending of the Grievous Maximus recording of Green River by CCR. <laughs> All right, but what if we want it to sound like an analog tape stopping effect? Let's see what we can do. Okay, let's go ahead and split it here right before this last note on the ring out. Do Command E, shortcut. And we're going to go ahead and cut off the tangent at the end to same shortcut, Command E, select it, and delete. All right, then the first thing we need to do is to slow it down. We'll use the pitch shift and verify plugin and this is uh, Digi's plugin that we can either use to speed up or slow down and we'll go ahead and click process there to slow that down and let's hear that back what that sounds like okay so what that's doing is it's slowing the speed down gradually uh, what we also want to do is to lower the pitch I'm going to use the Wave Sound Shifter plugin. You can use just about any pitch shifting plugin, though. And we're going to automate the pitch parameter of this plugin. And we'll go into the automation and add that pitch parameter there. And so now we can go over and select that parameter that we just added and select pitch. Okay. And then we'll choose our pencil tool and just draw in. We want it to go down in pitch, so we'll start there where we split it and go down. This will lower it one octave, and we'll go hear what that sounds like now. You can see the slider there in the plugin moving with our automation we just wrote in. But what if that's not enough? Uh, we want it to lower it down below the threshold of hearing. Uh, so we'll just add a couple more instances of the plugin, do uh, option, click and drag. And since it's the exact same plugin, it will triple that effect since there's three of those plugins. And there you have it.